dumb vibes is here to entertain you. Senzo Meiwa is undoubtedly and effortlessly one of the greatest legends so far that South Africa has in the history of football and of course he made sure that he did everything within his span capacity in order to put South Africa on the map and do things the right way. He was at the peak of his career when unfortunately some unscrupulous set of individuals decided to claim his life without his consent and without the consent of the heavens. In today's video, we are going to be giving you all some very insider details about how Senzo Meiwa's family member walks out of court as Tumelo Matlatla talks about Senzo and of course all of this is because of the twisted words of mouth of Tumelo and several people allege that he lies on several instances. Senzo Meiwa's family member just can't stand this. Before giving you all the detail proper, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel please, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell. On October 26, 2014, a shooting occurred in the Vosluru's residence of the mother of his girlfriend, singer Kelly Kumalo. Five men are currently on trial for the claiming of life of Senzu Meiwa. All of the five accused have pleaded not guilty. The people that were at the house on the day when everything actually occurred were Meiwa, Kelly and her younger sister Zandile, their mother Tombi Kumalo, Longa Tswala, Meiwa's friends Togozisi Tswala and Tumelo Matladla, Kelly's then four-year-old son Christian and Thingo, her daughter with Meiwa. One of the defense attorneys on Monday interrogated to Melo Matlatla, Meiwa's childhood best friend Matlatla had actually been charged with giving evasive answers by the case's defense and this pissed out a whole lot of people as to why he has actually decided to hide the truth from Senzo Meiwa's family. This has broken the hearts of so many. What a best friend. Some even have the Often tree to call him Judas Iscariot all over social media saying he has betrayed Senzo Meiwa just for very few amount of money given to him by other people and of course the culprits behind his claiming of life and to an extent Netflix who actually paid him huge amount of money for pictures and to be able to grant an interview about Senzo Meiwa. Senior SABC News journalist Criselda Zozi Lewis shared on Time updates about the trail on her Twitter account. She recently tweeted this happening now. One of the Meiwa family members walks out of court as Tumelo Madladla talks about Senzo Meiwa simply because of the discontent of actually seeing Madladla lying and twisting stories up. Unfortunately, these family members of Senzo Meiwa, if you ask me, I will tell you that they are actually not being so serious as far as this case is concerned. I know and understand that it's 8 years already and everybody wants the truth, but to the extent whereby they are going to be having secretive meetings with Chico Twala, who currently is, happens to be the father of the most accused, the highest suspect at the moment, Longwe Twala, and of course, who, why on earth would they have a meeting with Chico Twala in the backside without informing the court, without informing the nation about what he actually discussed? When Chico was even asked what is definitely his reason for going to actually see the Senzo Meiwa's family, he said he went there to support. He went to show his own support and even went as far as revealing that if his son Longwe Twala is responsible for claiming Senzo's life, then justice should be served. He is not going to do anything in order to protect or cover the child. I don't want to be so judgmental about this case but you will tell me in the comment section what you think about it because right now I'm really so confused and pissed as Senzo's family member left the court. 